Today, veterans and citizens of all ages came together to celebrate the 30th anniversary of the North Dakota Veterans Cemetery. KX News' Christina Randall takes us inside the ceremony. Hundreds of people came out to the North Dakota Veterans Cemetery today to celebrate its 30th anniversary. Throughout the ceremony, there were several keynote speakers, including Senator Kevin Kramer. He says today was about celebrating the past 30 years of accomplishments, but also to celebrate the future. Looking forward to how this cemetery will be of service to the men and women who will be of service to us for generations to come. 30 years ago, there were just a few graves on this plot of land. It's now the last resting place for over 11,000 veterans. It's something like this can only happen with the strong dedication of a few leaders and a whole bunch of volunteers who just care a lot. Al Dorman, adjutant general of the North Dakota National Guard, says the goal is to make the North Dakota Veteran Cemetery a place to honor those who gave the ultimate sacrifice. Uh, but our goal is just to make this the premier or a premier state veteran cemetery. And you talk to people that have been here and been to other state veteran cemetery, I think uh, we are achieving that vision. Senator Kramer says we live in a free country, but it comes at a cost. And sometimes we forget that. But forgive us when we don't thank you enough because the reason we don't think about the sacrifice you're making or willing to make is because we take for granted how easy our lives are. He says this cemetery is here to remind people of the cost of freedom over the years. For KX News, I'm Christina Randall. Also at the ceremony, former Adjutant General Alexander McDonald was honored with a plaque to recognize his role in making the cemetery a reality.